The Macau Black Bears began life without Anthony Tucker, while the West Port Malaysia Dragons needed a crucial win here in order to keep in distance with the Mono Vampire Basketball Club in the race for the final playoff spot in the ABL. Who would take this crucial victory? We go to the first quarter where Mike McKinney would roll up his sleeves and say, you know, Anthony Tucker, no problem, as he scored in transition. The Dragons still were feeling it early on behind the sweet shooting Chris Eversley from beyond the arc. And then they would add on another two points. First off, this gorgeous pass from Jonathan Wong as he finds Chin for that layup. Now Mike McKinney though, waltzing into the paint and getting that end one to fall. And he would finish the first period in style as he goes all the way and gets this beautiful floater in the free throw line to drop. The lead would go to the Black Bears after one. The second period, Wong putting the moves on the defense of Ryan Watkins and getting that crazy three to fall. And this pass from Nana Egu over to Yek, the sweet shooting big man from the left corner. That's good as well. Check out once again this passing from McKinney as he finds Tien from long distance who strokes that three. And then Watkins would get this three to fall and give the Black Bears a little bit of a cushion heading into the third frame. And in this third frame, it would be all Black Bears after that shot from Wong. As Watkins absolutely beasting all over Egu and getting that layup to fall. And the scorching run would break open this game in the third period. King knocking down a three. And then Watkins ending the period in style, giving the Black Bears a 24-point lead at the end of the third frame. In the fourth, it was just mop-up duty for the Black Bears as they would lead by as many as 32 points as they get a well-rounded and balanced performance from everyone wearing a white uniform. This would be the dagger, the icing on the ice cream for the Black Bears as they prevail in their first game without Anthony Tucker with a whopping 87-62 to victory.